In this Business Tech Planet video, we'll show you how to change your Microsoft 365 email address. But first, we're introducing the new Microsoft Teams Bible. It's free to download for all our newsletter readers. And you get all the essentials needed to get up and running in Microsoft Teams, including clear steps and images to guide you through the process. To start mastering Microsoft Teams, just hit the link and download your free copy. If you're using a personal Microsoft account, Head to Microsoft365.com and click your profile image in the top right. Then select my Microsoft account in the drop-down menu. When your account page opens in the browser window, head to the left menu. There, select your info. On the next page, scroll down to the account info section and click edit account info on the right side. Next, head down to account alias and choose to add an email address. You can now choose to create a new email, or you can add a different email that you already own. In this example, we'll choose to create a new email address. When you're done, hit the Add Alias button. Once you've added a new email address, head across and click Make Primary. Then click Yes to confirm. If you don't need the other email address, simply click Remove next to it. Then click Remove again to confirm. If you're using a business account, you won't be able to change your email address. However, if you're an admin, you can change someone's email address from the admin center. Starting from Microsoft365.com, click the app launcher in the top left. Then select admin in the list of applications. In the admin center, scroll down and locate the person whose email you need to change. Or, click users in the left menu. Then select active users. On the active users page, click the search box in the top right and type the person's name and hit enter. Now click the three dots next to their name and choose edit username. Or you can click their name. Click manage username and email. Then click the pen icon located on the right side. Next, change the username to create a new email address. And when you're finished, hit done. That's all for this video. Please leave a comment if this helped, and hit the subscribe button for more Microsoft videos. Also, for all the latest Microsoft news, and free exclusive resources, be sure to click the link in the description, and grab our weekly newsletter.